Would I ever stream on Kick? Um, I'll be honest, I didn't hear good things about Kick. Like, I've heard that Kick isn't very moddable, meaning, like, it's pretty hard to moderate over there and control the, the dialogue in a chat, in which case I wouldn't want to stream there because I have so many trolls, you know that they would try to ruin it for my community. Like... Oh, my God. These fucking trolls are so boring. They do the same shit over and over. God, it's the same shit, too. It's like, they don't think of anything original or interesting. It's the same fucking stuff, man. If you can't really mod well, how are we going to stop trolling to the point where people who actually like the content can, can chat? Like here, look, we can all have a conversation, right? Over there, I've heard you can't really do that. No one, like literally no one is talking to me. They're all, everyone's having their own conversations about bullshit. What are you talking about? So I wouldn't want to do that. In addition, you know, I like having my content in one place. I like it that people know that I'm streaming here. I put my videos here. To separate myself into many different places when I don't have a giant viewer base probably wouldn't work. Um, I would much rather have it all in one spot. And already I don't have a giant viewer base. It would be one thing if I was like, oh, yeah, every time I stream, I get thousands of people. Oh, I'll, I'll stream everywhere. But I don't have that. I don't have that kind of, of that kind of clout, that kind of draw. So um, earlier today, I fully and formally addressed on my pre-stream, um, you know, the whole situation that happened with me on Twitter last night and yesterday. It's still unfolding. We've still got people going crazy tweeting about it uh, as of right now. My one main tweet that's been super popular has over 15,000 likes and 4,000 retweets, while the other tweet that I made has about 5,000 likes and, like, thousands of retweets. Is it? See, I don't know. I only know what I've heard. I've never streamed. I'm not saying that streaming on Kick would always be out of the question or whatever. I've also heard the revenue model over there is bizarre because they pay a ton of money, yet people are like, there's no way that's sustainable, and they're going to, like, definitely change that or go out of business. And I'm like, I, I have a model here that works. The contributions I get on these streams, the ad revenue I get on these streams, I make a living. So I'm not looking to get rich quick on kick and then have the whole thing fall apart either, you know? And again, I'm just going to say this, all right? Ignore any trolling. Ignore any nonsense. Uh, already it's beginning, so I'm going to set up a little pinned message here, okay? There we go. Pin the message. Now there's no excuse. Please ignore the nonsense. If I see people bringing it up, I'm just going to start moderating. I, I, didn't, I don't know about it until you guys tell me. I literally don't look at view count. So I have no idea who, how many people are on any of my streams at all. I really don't. Um, but you guys bring it up, and I'm like... And the thing is, again, with those view bots, they don't count. They don't give me actual views. They don't give me ad revenue. It's a fake thing that people do that floods the stream and and basically just, oh, look at that, look at that. It's It's stupid. Don't give attention. It's like looking at some moron in the middle of the street freaking out, ripping his clothes off, defecating all over the pavement. Just ignore him and walk by him, okay? <laughs> Pay no heed to the nonsense. <clears throat> all right, well, I received a $50 tip from Waffins, who says, I hope your night is going well. Well, thank you, Waffins, for a $50 tip. I appreciate this. Now, Waffins, I really hope that you're legit, and the reason I say that, please understand that I'm not ungrateful, but I have to be skeptical because... There's a few people, you're one of them, who recently have just mysteriously started coming by my streams and doing these contributions, and I don't really know you that well. You just kind of started joining, right? And I appreciate it because I know you became a member, and you've done Super Chats as well, and now you're doing these tips. I really appreciate it, but I just hope that it's real, and I just want to bring up with everyone that already trolls have come out and admitted that over the last month, they have organized an effort to give me tips, and then basically they're going to all charge them back later in the month. That's what they're saying. They're going to try to, at the end of this month, hit me with a ton of chargebacks, which of course would really screw up my business, and I can't stop that. Phil, your days are done. You, We know that you've been committing tax fraud, and we are going to get you. Ha ha ha. I would have to argue and dispute them all. I just hope that, you know, you get a few new people. There was Waffens, there's also this um, Thorax, the plumber, who came by last month with a or, or last night actually with a super generous tip, and it's like I just hope that these are legit. And the fact that Waffens already did other contributions makes me feel a little bit better about it. It's not that they're illegitimate. Someone just said I thought that pay that PayPal validates tips. It's not that stuff's illegitimate. It's that people lie after the fact and commit fraud. Like literally, they will say to to PayPal, "Oh, uh, 
that was not authorized or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So there you go. And no, Sarah, there's no way that I cannot acknowledge a contribution until it hits my bank account. I mean, would you never want me to shout out contributions ever? I mean, that's what it would be then. I would literally never be shouting anything out. Because keep in mind, it is fraud. It's actually a crime. I'm not joking. It's a crime to lie to PayPal and say, oh, that was an unauthorized transaction. Uh, or, you know, oh, I didn't mean to do this. Or, you know, sometimes they just lie outright about bullshit. They'll be like, oh, uh, you know, this was this was a sale on PayPal. Like, no, it wasn't. <laughs> there was no sale. There was no no sale transpired. You know, but they'll they'll try to be bullshitting in order to try to fuck around. And then I, I clap back and I say, no, they fucked me again, left and right. And my ass is so fucking stretched out at this point. It's time to push back. <laughs> Absolutely not. Here's the evidence. You know, here's my my PayPal page where people tips through. It says right on it. It says no refunds. It's a tip that was lively live shout out. Here's the evidence. Here's the moment of the video where it happened. And, you know, it's in the hands of PayPal. Sometimes it works. Sometimes it doesn't. You know, I just hope that, again, this isn't like a concerted effort by a bunch of people that all of a sudden at the end of this month now I'm going to get a ton of chargebacks back to back. That would really hurt me. So anyway, I hope it's legit. And again, Waffens, please understand, I'm not I'm not trying to talk negatively about you or saying that I believe that this is, you know, that you're faking or anything. I'm just saying, you know, I got to be skeptical. It's you and literally you and maybe three other people recently have come by in the last couple of weeks and all of a sudden I'm getting these tips. It's like, hmm. Hmm. Right? It would be one thing if I knew it was like a regular or someone, you know, who like we talking and chatting. But all of a sudden, all at once, a few people coming by and doing these tips. Just to forewarn you, uh, it is a crime what you're doing. And, uh, you know, I'll do my best. If for anyone who has ideas, again, not saying that this is Waffens, but anyone who has ideas that they're going to commit a crime, yeah, I don't let it go. I'll go right to PayPal with all the evidence. I'll tell them they should be prosecuting. And, uh, you know, we'll see what happens. Normally, I wouldn't address this, but I have to say this, okay? Someone actually just sent me a dollar and said, Tevin has given more back to his fans and to charity than you ever have, and you make more money than him. He breaks the law. You literally might as well say, yeah, well, the drug dealer down the fucking street you know, donates to charity and does nice things for his customers. He breaks the law. So where's Stealth? This it? No, that's regeneration. How do I use Stealth? Stealth. Okay. What the? Oh, what the fuck? I was just trying to look at my shit. I died already? Oh, come on. That was awful. I didn't get to use it at all. I was trying to look at my abilities. I died instantly. God damn. And people are, okay, why are we talking about this? I'm just going to ignore it. I mean, seriously, like, people, here we are. We're having fun. We're playing Star Wars, right? We're having a good time. I think I'll tip Phil and I'll talk about chargebacks. Uh, no. How about not? Nah? How about we play Star Wars and have fun and have a silly night and not worry about fucking chargebacks, right? Like, what are you talking about? <sighs> All right. If we can get some bans on some of these idiots in the stream chat who obviously are only here to be stupid. <laughs> we, let's just dampen the mood. Sure. The enemy has captured the command post. The enemy has captured a spot. They're a bunch of wily dicks. They're a bunch of stupid pricks. I fire the rocket into their balls. I roll, I roll, I roll again. I fire my rocket and again. They dodge it. It's such bullshit. Suck my ass. Oh, suck my ass. Suck my ass. Yeah, he died. I finally got him. That's what I was singing. Suck my ass. That's why he died. I hope you'll suck my ball sack tonight, you stupid troops. Baboosh. He still didn't die? Did you see that? Did I not hit him with two rockets? Come on, dude. Mark says, the Zangief Master video from last night was great. I'm glad you enjoyed it. It was glorious finally hitting Master Rank with Zangief last night after all of that trouble that it gave me. But now we're done, and now we're ready for next week, right? We are ready for the rebalance patch one week from today. We're ready for Akuma. Akuma Matata, what a wonderful phrase, Akuma Matata, it means, uh, raging demons, all the rest of your days, it's my satsu free philosophy, Akuma Matata, what did I miss, I missed, Akuma Matata, Akuma Matata.
Uh oh. Oh, what? Uh. How about get the fuck out of here because your connection sucks? I'm not playing you again, idiot. That sucked. Obviously, that was not my internet because, as you can see, the stream is still working. And the game dropped. Yeah, the game totally dropped. Well, fudge. You know, I think the whole game dropped everyone because why would there be no sessions? Right? I think the game dropped absolutely everyone playing. <laughs> Obviously, my LAN cable didn't disconnect, right? I'm still online here. Yeah, see? It was the game. It was the servers. LAN cable disconnected? What are you talking about, right? I'm still online. You can see all the activity is still working and everything. All this would be, like, offline if it wasn't working. It's definitely online. So, the game crapped out. Now we're going to have to wait. We're totally going to have to wait for them to start making servers again. Someone's going to have to make a server and get people to start joining it. Yeah, see? Man. Ha <laughs> ha. Man, we were having fun. We were having fun, and then that had to happen. Like, this ain't going to help, because you know what happened? All the servers just went down. So now people have to, like, jo rejoin and start the servers over again. Oh, man. That was some crap. Uh, and by the way, I just want to say thank you again to Waffins for the big tip. For everyone tonight who supported in some way. Uh, I appreciate that. Uh, if you like this content, if you like the chill sessions, please support them. Super chats, memberships, tips, all appreciated. Uh, like I said, I am nervous about the fact that there seems to be an effort by trolls to have nights like tonight where everything's kind of hinging on one person and then they claim they're going to charge that shit back later. I'm not saying Waffins is a troll. I don't know. But it would be nice if you know you guys are enjoying the content, if you could support in other ways. What they're trying to do, they come in, they drop a big tip, and they're like, ha-ha, now no one will contribute tonight. Because everyone thinks Phil's doing good, and then they're gonna charge back later. That's their that's their intention. They've publicly said this in places because they're morons. These fucking idiots. I don't know. I think this is gonna be my last match of the night. Uh, not to say that I'm gonna quit the stream, but I don't, I'm not feeling. It. You guys aren't even talking about the game. You're talking to me. But I feel like since we're disconnected, we should just maybe hang out for half an hour before I adjourn because I don't want to. Have you guys be bored? Like, literally, no one's talking in the chat right now. It's dead completely. <laughs> you guys are just not paying attention. So, man, that's good. That's actually genuinely good. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? I need feedback. Stop talking about stupid fucking Kanye West bullshit. And let's talk about the game, because I'm going to be pissed off if you start derailing the stream of bullshit. No one cares about fucking Kanye West. <clears throat> Acorn or free money from the perps? Hmm. Interesting. It's cool looking at that board. Uh, you guys are super quiet today. What's going on? Why are you guys not talking that much? Did you fall asleep, everybody? Are you asleep on the stream? Should I uh, should I turn some like, like uh, lullabies on for you guys? La la loo, la la loo, dream peacefully, star sweeper, la la loo. 